You've got to spend money to make money. And when you're talking Hollywood blockbusters, that means tens of millions just to get a hit cast in place. But when the cameras start rolling, there's no telling how high the costs or profits will end up climbing. Whether the studio dodges a bullet or winds up with a dud, these movie price tags will make your head spin. Here are the 10 most expensive movie scenes in history. Superman Returns Although the star of the movie is younger, Superman Returns actually picks up not long after Superman 2, with Clark telling his mother that he traveled all the way back to his home planet of Krypton, only to find it in pieces. But that scene was originally meant to open the movie, with the special effects needed to make the planet's remains and the crystal ship Clark piloted to them costing more than $10 million, a record for most expensive deleted movie scene that most likely will not be broken. The Matrix Reloaded When the first sequel to The Matrix was greenlit, the studio knew the box office would be massive which meant the directors got a chance to do something incredible. Shoot a 17 minute long scene starring Keanu Reeves doing a battle scene with an endless mob of Agent Smith clones. The special effects needed to replace faces and eventually render a completely digital fight sequence racked up a price tag of $40 million, almost half the movie's budget. Considering the effects weren't actually a hit with every fan, it might not have all been money well spent. World War Z Having to reshoot a complicated scene or sequence can get expensive fast. But what about when you have to make a brand new third act? That's what happened with this Brad Pitt-led zombie war film, when a massive 12-minute battle sequence in Russia was scrapped and a brand new ending was written and filmed. The new ending may have been smaller in scale, but the studio had already paid for the first version. In the end, the budget ballooned from $120 million up to $170, with most fans still wishing they'd seen the original version. Go! Evan Almighty. Massive budgets used to be rare, but Hollywood has made them commonplace. But if there's one movie that sums up Hollywood's production gone completely insane, it's the sequel to Bruce Almighty starring Steve Carell. Why the studio ever agreed to fund the construction of an actual arc is a mystery on its own. But every aspect of the movie, from the individual hairs on Carell's fake beard painstakingly applied, to animals rendered to the finest detail sent the budget out of control. In the end, the movie cost around $200 million to make, and its horrible reviews and massive loss showed by comedy blockbusters are a rare thing. Not about money. It's about sending a message. The Dark Knight The hospital explosion scene in The Dark Knight is one of the most memorable, but the building itself was a clever bit of construction. The parking ramp was scheduled to be demolished by the city of Chicago, so if the production paid to build a fake hospital around it, they'd kill two birds with one stone. But it still cost $700,000 to build, and when you're burning almost a million dollars on a single scene, literally, it better turn out perfectly. It did, and it sent a message. Pearl Harbor Michael Bay's World War II movie didn't win over critics, but the battle scenes were something else. He saved the biggest explosion for the bombing of Pearl Harbor, and paid serious money to get the most out of it. After working with multiple government departments and local groups to detonate explosions in the harbor safely, the blast itself relied on a dozen camera teams, 7,000 sticks of dynamite, and 4,000 gallons of gasoline, for a total price tag of around $5.5 million. In the finished film, the explosion lasts for mere seconds. Avatar. It's directors like James Cameron who help break down technological barriers and push movie making into a new age. But it isn't cheap. Cameron set a record for the biggest film budget with each of his ambitious adventures, but hit a high watermark with Avatar, coming in at over a quarter of a billion dollars before a dollar came in from theaters. The investment paid off, as it always has, and started a new age of 3D, and higher ticket prices for everyone. Avengers Age of Ultron by the time the second Avengers team-up came along, fan expectations had reached insane heights, which meant insane budgets to match. Rumors suggested that the stars of the film demanded serious raises to appear as well, as high as $5 million per actor and a cut of the back-end profits. Combine that with the massive battle scenes and the finished movie came in at almost $300 million, twice the budget of the original Iron Man movie that started it all. The Avengers in hindsight, the first big screen team up of Marvel's heroes was a guaranteed hit, combining the solo movie heroes to cross the billion dollar mark. But at that time, it was still Iron Man pulling in the biggest crowds. Robert Downey Jr. knew that without him, the Avengers could not be as big or as profitable as Marvel needed. In the end, it cost Marvel $50 million just to sign Downey to the picture, over a third of what it cost to make his original film. But hey, you can't say it wasn't worth every penny. John Carter Ambition and marketing aren't always guaranteed to bring in the big payday, as Disney and director Andrew Stanton learned with John Carter. The movie itself was visually stunning, and as big and epic as fans would hope it would be. But when post-production issues forced much of the movie to basically be shot twice, later estimates claim the movie would have to make over half a billion dollars to break even for Disney. And with the critical slaughter at release, it didn't even come close, making it Disney's biggest flop to date. 
So those are the insanely expensive movie scenes, sequences, box office hits, and bombs we could think of. But which ones did we miss? Let us know in the comments section below, and remember to subscribe to our channel for more fun videos like this one.